I came out this morning, I got a text on it early this morning, and I said, oh, I'll have to come out to North. So I've been here all day, um, and then uh, myself and Robert King, like, we need to get some community um, involved. So we've been on the phone all morning, and you see kind of the turnout. Um, it's really been, uh, I think, a great opportunity for the community to come out and let people know this is not going to be tolerated in this community. It's tough for officers to come and see the graffiti that was on the back side of the building, uh, to drive in and see that in the mornings. Stuff like, you know, kill all cops, cops need to die, all cops are bastards. Those things, it's demoralizing for officers. And they've been working, you know, for weeks on end, 12 hour shifts, um, either downtown or here to protect buildings, still answer calls for service. And it's, it's difficult to come in and feel like, uh, you know, your whole life's work, no one appreciates it. And there was a lot of businesses up and down here once they dispersed, so they just damaged all the way up, top to bottom, and the bank. And uh, it's hardworking people who are just trying to make a living. COVID's, you know, been such an impediment for them already. And then to have this destruction and looting to their businesses is just, just terrible.